Hi, I'm Jesse with Lally Low, and today I'm going to talk to you all about the student placement test. The placement test is a really great tool to help put your students exactly where they need to be according to their individual skills. When students first log into Lally Low for the very first time, the first thing that they're going to do is take the placement test. It doesn't need to be skipped because it's just going to help place them in the correct spot. It should take them about 10 minutes. When they first click start, they'll hear this message. Hello Explorer, are you ready to go on an adventure? Before we begin, we'll do some training to know exactly where you are in your learning. Concentrate and try your best so that we can find the best starting point for you in the worlds of Lalilo. When you're ready to begin, click on Let's Go. From here, they'll click Let's Go and get started with their placement test. Once they're finished, you'll be able to see their progress in your student in your teacher dashboard. You'll just look through all of your students and see which ones have striped gray tiles. Most of my students right now have not completed the placement test, so they have just plain gray tiles. But Trevor has completed his placement test, and I can see the striped gray tiles that show me that he has completed these lessons through the placement test. So if I hover over one, I can see what the actual content is. So I know that Trevor is not going to be working on the exercises for the NK blend or for the CVCE words because he's already done that work in the placement test and doesn't need to revisit it. Where he has gray tiles, that's how I know what content he's going to be starting on. And as for my other students, as soon as they take their placement test, I'll see striped gray tiles for them as well to show me what they've already accomplished through the placement test. Another helpful tool is this banner at the top of your teacher dashboard. When your students are currently working on the placement test, you will see this banner and it'll let you know how many of your students have completed it. You can also click on this button here to see a little PDF that explains a little bit more about the placement test. Also, some teachers wonder about selecting their grade level or um, whether or not they need to assign the placement test and you don't need to really worry about either of those. When you create your class, just choose whichever grade level you teach and the placement test will figure out exactly where your students need to go. Um, that grade level you selected will just tell the placement test uh, which question to give students first and from there it will just depend on their skill levels. So there's really no need for teachers to do any guesswork and since it's automatic, you also don't need to assign it. It should take students about 10 minutes um, and they should be able to get through it pretty quickly and easily.